Oh, hey, how's it going? <laughs> you caught me off guard, kind of. I'm on YouTube. I don't know how that happened. Anyway, how are you? It's early in the morning here. Jonathan in the booth, coffee in hand. Uh, still waking up, frankly. Got a big e-learning thing I have to tackle today, so I'm getting in early. But I want to send. I wanted to send one more message before the end of the year. I won't be sending one in the next couple of weeks because everybody's going to be in holiday mode, solstice mode, whatever your cup of tea is there. And uh, the reason for the message is this. I was fortunate enough to get a, a message of hope from the universe last night. I was uh, up in my, my gallery. So this is like a combined space where I have my studio, obviously here, and then my gallery where I display artwork in the front. It's called Hi-Fi Jones, by the way, if you want to check it out. Anyway, I'm hanging out up there, and these two younger people came in. In an earlier incarnation of this video, I called them young folks, and then immediately I, <laughs> I felt very old. Anyway, these two young people came in. Start talking with them. One is going to school for audio production. That's what I went to school for. The other one is just a very kind of bubbly young woman. And here are the things that impressed me about them and gave me, frankly, hope for the future. Number one, they both played a pretty good game of Donkey Kong. Well played. I don't know, are they Gen Z? I don't even know what the generations are called anymore. Have we cycled back to A? It's like naming hurricanes. But they played a pretty good game of Donkey Kong. Okay, feeling hopeful. But what they really and seriously said that gave me hope was they said, you know, we're just kind of out walking around. Well, I guess we're just kind of nerdy like that. We're just going to walk around and go to the bookstore. And I thought, no, that's, that's not nerdy. That's what you do. That's what people do is they, they walk around. They read books. They interact face to face and have conversations when they're not looking at their phone. I actually don't think I saw either of them pull a phone out the entire time they were here. So as much as I'm, of course, sort of joking around a little bit, I also felt that real sense of like, wow, everything's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. I do hope for all of us that not only will 2022 be a better year than 2021, although I hope you had some bright spots, in this past year, I did for sure. But that at the end of 2022, uh, when we're all doing this again, 12 months from now, we can say, it was a pretty good year. Hope you're doing well. Sending you peace and love. See you next time.